Hey guys, welcome back. So I just finished building the galley hatch framework. If you stick around, I'll show you how I did it. Hey guys, so here's the basic frame for the galley hatch. I'm uh, gonna go ahead and do some cross supports and get it skinned. And I'm gonna actually mount it semi-permanently in other words it's not going to open as a temporary fix <clears throat> so that I can 
hopefully use the camper this weekend. So I wanna do the final installation. It'll be hinged right across here. You know, and then the thing will open up this way. And I'll have aluminum scan on the outside and aluminum trim here that's got a channel for weather stripping. And so the scan on the hatch will only come to about right here and it'll be offset a little bit by about a quarter of an inch. And then it's gonna have trim that comes across. So when it shuts, the trim will sit right on top of that weather stripping without squishing it down. But I don't have all the stuff I need to do that and don't have the time because I'm supposed to leave tomorrow to go on a camp out. So what I'm going to do is cut the trim or cut the, the skin for the, the hatch wider to where it comes all the way out here. Instead of stopping here, it'll come all the way out here and I'm going to screw it in temporarily. So the whole hatch will be rigid and not open. And then come up to about right here. I'll seal the front edge and then I'm going to paint the whole thing tonight with an outdoor paint. And then hopefully be able to, after the paint dries, put the window and door in and it'll be enclosed and dry. And I'll be able to, to camp in it this weekend. Won't have any electric electrical in it yet. Inside's not going to be finished, but it'll be usable. So that's where I'm at right now. I'm going to go ahead and get these uh, cross members or, or cross supports cut and installed, and then I'm going to start to skin it and get it going. So stay tuned. Here we go. Galley hatch frame is done. I just got to skin it. And we'll be good to go.